we are going to be discussing character archetypes, specifically those that are most often used for main characters. The archetypes for protagonists include the hero, believer, or dreamer, the innocent, logician, explorer, everyday man, the warrior, leader, detective, lover, outcast, and the outlaw. The hero archetype is very broad, but essentially, a hero is a character who sacrifices their life or something precious and valuable for the sake of others. Most hero characters are young to show that they are still learning and not yet ready to defeat the antagonist. The best hero designs show the progression of strength and ability that the character had to obtain in order to overcome the villain or the design will show the hero's natural state of goodness and strong sense of justice. The Believer and Dreamer are the characters whose thoughts and ideas challenge society or lead the characters around them towards a better life. The Believer archetype works best for characters in a society or environment whose people will benefit from them revealing their flawed or corrupt thinking. I noticed that some commonalities between these character types are the colors orange and yellow and their innocent or trustworthy appeal. Logicians are the protagonists who love to analyze, know the facts, run experiments, and make plans in order to overcome the challenges they face. They're often very confident and like to have control over their environment. Stereotypes such as glasses and a lab coat can be helpful to quickly identify these characters. Innocent characters overcome the challenges and the evil intent of the antagonist through the goodness of their heart. They are loyal, enduring, kind, and often portrayed by female protagonists as well as children, animals, and any character that is cute and has an innocent appeal. Explorers are one of my favorite character archetypes. They are motivated by making new discoveries, learning new information, and going on amazing adventures. These characters have special tools and equipment such as a backpack, walking stick, and notepad to help them record information, protect themselves, and navigate on their journey. This archetype is best used for characters in occupations that require a lot of travel and discovery, such as astronauts, sailors, pilots, and miners. The everyday man is commonly used for characters who possess an ability or privilege that others are not allowed to know about. Whether the character is an animal, alien, or human being, their initial outfit should be consistent with the normal attire in their society. The everyday man archetype is also used and storylines that revolve around the protagonist, self-discovery, and lessons learned in everyday life. Warriors and fighters are often the protagonists in video games and movies. We admire them for their persistence, bravery, and unique combat skills. The most critical aspects of this character design are the weapons and armor. Context clues on their mission and authority are also important for the design. The leader archetype is a character who is confident, level-headed, and creative in the guidance of their team. Sharp shape language can be used to show the determination, resolve, and fighting spirit the leader has. Using the colors red and or blue can help the audience quickly identify the leader. Using the audience's prior knowledge of authority in your design, such as a lion or a sheriff, is also helpful for the audience to quickly identify the leader. The detective archetype is sadly one of the most underrated on this list. This archetype falls into a subcategory under the logician 
where the character has to rely on prior knowledge, clues, and new information. The costume design of Detective ranges from more formal attire to casual attire, especially if the detective is not officially certified. However, brown colors and trench coats, as well as glasses, are the main look. Lover archetypes' thoughts and actions are consumed by the object of their affection. They are fiercely loyal and often possess traits such as intelligence, strength, and intuition to aid their person or object of interest. Colors pink and red are very prevalent in this design choice. Most frequently, this design style is focused on a lovable female who is overlooked by her love interest or Prince Charming who has the capacity to save his damsel in distress. More original versions of this archetype are inspired by clear and simple truths. For example, an animal loves food, a parent loves their children, and a child loves their toys. Outcasts are some of the most memorable and lovable archetypes, as we've all felt like we don't belong at some point. Deformities and bizarre physical traits are a quick and effective way to identify your character as the outcast. Giving your character subtle or major differences in their outfit, shape language, or colors also identifies them as the outcast. Outlaws are another one of my favorite archetypes. Whether they're taking the law into their own hands or simply trying to go after their own desires, these characters are lovable for their charismatic and witty personality. The elements of these character designs should allow the audience to question whether or not they can truly trust them. These are some of the most interesting characters to design because they're highly unpredictable and keep the audience on their toes. All right, here's a summary and review of all of the character archetypes. Once you get a hang of connecting these archetypes to your protagonist, your character design will have a greater appeal and intrigue for your audience. If you like this video, please like, share, subscribe, and leave a comment on one of your favorite protagonists in the comments below. Dream big, live bold, and keep on creating. I'll see you next time.